If you miss the animals at the Columbus Zoo and Aquarium, don't worry, the feeling's mutual. But it is funny because when I walk by, they'll stop and they're like, wait, who's that? You know, so I, I think that, uh, I think that they can't wait to see our guest as well. Zoo director Tom Stolf says the zoo could actually open up now. They're just waiting for the green light from the state. If they gave us a go ahead, uh, we'd be open in about an hour. And every hour they're not, Stolf says the money hit gets harder and harder. The zoo's already had to furlough workers. We're losing nearly $2 million every week. If we open in, in the beginning of June, um, we will have lost $30 million. Here's a quick look at how an opening would look. The zoo's going to let less people in, use timed ticketing, designated one ways for social distancing on some of the more narrow paths, and allow groups of no more than 10. Our staff, you know, they're, they are protecting themselves and protecting the animals. Uh, all of our team will be wearing face masks and um, while they're with the animals. And um, you'll see them, right? it'll be a requirement for all of our staff. Uh, there will not be a requirement for the general public to come in with masks, but we'll ask everyone just to stay safe and keep their social distancing. Stauff says the zoo could literally open anytime. All they need is a yes. We want to make sure that you know, as you come to the Columbus Zoo and Aquarium, we're prepared for you, and we're going to make sure that you have a great day. I'm Nick Lawton, Ohio 24-7 Now.